What is up guys, today we have some battles for my route to 1500 TMR showcasing the power of nerd guys, so please enjoy. What do we have here? Mr. Shaftsbury, go with the regular team. <clears throat> Is our friend going to pick here? Da -da -da. What do we got? Okay, we have a... Ooh, fucking... Everyone's flexing on me today. What's my Lutner's at? Um, okay, so what are we scared of here? I mean, it's probably going to be Drill, right? So he's got the, three tox uh, the two Toxics and the... The Grumpy here, which means my Nagais isn't that great. Um, maybe I can pick it up later in the game. I don't think he's gonna be too scared of it. Uh, but dude, this is very similar to my old team. Uh, what's he gonna bring? What What am I super super scared of right now? Like the Firefish is kind of scary, but I mean, like again, he has three ways through Valash. Um, let's get rid of Firefish and see what he does here. Gulder. Okay, he might ban out Gulder and just leave Nagais, because Nagais does, as I said, look pretty shitty late game. Um, If I pick Kinu, what's he pick? Like, he kind of doesn't have the best team into Kinu here. I mean, it's probably going to be one of these three. Like, they're the only ones that can really touch it. Uh, but yeah, I do like Kinu Valash, especially if he doesn't open with uh, Raikin. Like, he kind of has to go Raikin, or he has to go um, Grandpa. Like, if he, if he doesn't take those two, then I just Valash, and I just Madness buff turn one, I think. Plus, his double uh, neutrals look kind of bad, especially with the Nagais still in the pool. Like, I feel like this guy will, like, leave Nagais, so it could be, like, a nice late game pick. Just to make sure I can finish off Thames like Momo. But, I do know due to the, uh, due to auto-scaling, Momo's double edge will actually outspeed Nagais if I'm not using Sci Surge. Hmm. What's he pick here? I think... He Okay, yeah, he goes Raik and he goes Kinu. Interesting. Uh, I can't really Valash into that, can I? I mean, I can actually just go Madness buff off the rip, though. Yeah, I think I'm going to do this. And then we're just going to ban Grumpa. Because, yeah, like, he definitely was scared of the Valash here. Uh, that's why he's taking these two. He wants the buff and he wants to be able to, like, threaten me turn one. But, yeah, you've kind of left this. And then what, you're going to like take these two, I'll Madness buff up, and then just switch out and use it endgame, I think. Like, I'll be plus one as well. Like, I can always get more buffs on the guys later. Because I don't think... Does he keep Raiken in? A good chance he switches Raiken, right? If he bans for Lash, I go endgame with Koish and these two, I think. Do we still like for Lash late game? Definitely get rid of this. Opens up Nagais a lot more. This probably has Drill, but I don't have Gula, so it doesn't matter. Um, was it my pick? Yeah. I think I really like Fire Koish here. Fire Koish, like, is really good against everything but Calibus. I think he definitely goes Calibus, yeah. He's too scared of Nagais. Uh, and because of this, definitely want the, uh, definitely want the Voltron. He's only scared of Raiken, right? Momo's also not really scared of anything. I'm going to go... Because I feel like I haven't picked Momo at all today. Um, look, I don't think I'm going to have a chance to set up, so I'm going to go Momo. Because I, I have ways through Kinu that isn't um that isn't the Valash. I can fire punch it, I can Nox Bomb it. Like, I don't need too many things to deal with it. Curious to see what he does here, though. Because Raiken is going to be very slow. But I am actually, uh, I am Strange Vest too. So Raiken actually won't do too much. Even if he does attack. That shows, I'm pretty sure that means... Wait, what? Okay, so I got the plus one first, which means I should be faster, right? Or could he switch in? He's definitely going to bring in Calibus. But the question is, which slots are coming into, right? Like, he can't trap me with anything. Calibus, 100% is coming in. There's no way it's not. Uh, let's just chip down Raiken then, I think. And we'll Madness buff. Oh, he actually gets as well. Oh, I'm a dickhead. Why did I stay in? <laughs> that was really fucking stupid. Okay. Well, good news is, though. He now has no way to threaten me. 
I'm plus three. Ooh, that was really silly of me, actually. I can't believe I've done that. Um, well, what's he do here? I don't want to bring in Koish just because if he switches into Calibus, I've got it like double switch there. I don't want to go into Momo because I can't really threaten out this. I'm going to go Voltron here, I think. Oh, that was actually so bad by me. I, sh I should have switched 100%. Like, I literally have Firefish sitting there waiting for that punch. And then I could have switched Firefish out the next turn or the guys. Um, question is, he probably switches Kinu now, so I'm probably just going to Feather Gatling calling the switch, and then we might even just Nagai's Fury here. Like, Raiken at plus 3 is not going to do much damage to me here, I don't think. Is this the Calibus swap? Okay, that's the Voltron swap. That's not too bad for me. It's not ideal, though. I'm not going to do much to either of these, but the chip damage is okay. Yeah, that's 30% on each. He Hypnosis Voltron. That's okay. It's actually probably really good that I don't get the speed buff this turn. Um, we'll keep this for later. And what do I want to bring in here? Do I want to bring in the Fire Fish? No, we'll bring in the Momo, I think. This is really bad. That, that initial turn's really fucked me, I think. Like, I really needed Kunu, like, alive to just, like, switch in. But we like playing from behind. Don't go into the Momo. Fuck, it's on Momo. Okay. If he doesn't double Momo here. Okay, he doubles Momo, but that's a tornado. That shouldn't do much, should it? Okay, that's actually really good. Now he doesn't have any priority. I can sh oh. Alright. This is an ideal. I'm gonna have to go hyperkinetic. Actually, who's faster in my two Thames? Momo is really quick on this team. Uh, 190. Okay, Momo's two points faster. Perfect. We're gonna hyperkinetic and we're gonna bark. Because he's definitely... Oh, who's he going into? Voltron. Okay. That's big though. I get a kill here onto Voltron. Kinu's... He's probably using Kinu to finish off Momo. Which, really fucking bad. But, it's fine. We take out Voltron. Yeah. Volerand is dead. It's going to be a dead Momo. Yeah. Okay, that's... Look, this is not a good position to be in, but that's an overexerted Kinu. Like, he has to bring in Calibus right now, I think, just because he's going to have to fear the Nagais coming in. But there's not much I do about it. Like, I kind of need Calibus gone. If I get rid of Calibus, Nagais might win this. But it's going to be fucking rough. Like, if he does bring in Calibus right now, I think it's a throw. Yeah. But it's fine. I should be able to kill that in two turns, maybe. The question comes down to does Kinu live? I think it does. And we'll... Is there any point in fire punching? I mean, yeah. Raikin's probably coming in. But... Yeah. I should have water cannon that slot, actually. That was the play. Oh, actually, it's Momo. I still think water cannon was my best play because I toxic anything that comes in there. Oh, jeez. Is he coat? Yeah, he's coat. All right. Toxic Ink into Koish, that's okay. I am actually a very fast Koish, so I might even get a at speed Momo here if he's not very fast. Ah, uh, what's my priority though right now? I'm negative two. Momo 100% one shots me here. I'm just gonna hyperkinetic. I have a feeling I'm dead this turn. Um, honestly, this thing just has to die. Do I want to? I'm not too scared of Momo right now. That's my thought process. Like, Momo can stick around if it wants. Hypnosis is sick. I'm faster than Momo. Koish probably goes down here, but it means Volorant can uh, get one more turn in. Although it does nothing with one more turn, I don't think. Um, but I... Oh, is Nagai's Fury up? I don't think Nagai's Fury is up right now. Damn, and I bet this thing's built to underspeed me anyway, isn't it? 
I think this all comes down to whether or not I get my attack off first. Which is Momo. Because if, if I am able to pick up the kill right now, I can maybe just Nagas Fury next turn. But I think Calibus kills me right now. Oh, it doesn't. Wow, auto scaling OP. Alright, that's sick. Because Volorant comes alive now too. And we know Raiken can't one shot me, so he's going to have to double Nagas here. Okay. This guy's getting so fucking big, though. Man, I threw this turn one, too. If I just didn't fucking feed this guy the buff, I think this game would be, like, ten times fucking easier. Can he kill me? I'm plus three special defense, but I am strange vest, which means Kinu's only attacking plus one. Um... I mean, this comes down to, am I strong enough to take out the Riken? I don't think even at plus two, I'm taking him out. Because my Volorant's probably still slower, right? Ketsa into Volorant. Yeah, okay. Honestly, that's not the worst thing ever. Ah, okay. I think I got to kill Kinu here, and then I, I try win with a... Um, with a Nagai's Fury into the two of them. Because Nagai's Fury definitely kills the Raiken. But the question is, does Raiken kill me before I get Nagai's Fury off? Plus three Strange Vest into, against plus two. Oh. Oh, it's a special attack. Oh, and we tank it. Okay. Oh. Fuck. He has double edge up, right? I don't know the calc, man. 54% Nagas Fury. Fuck it. YOLO. I think the, the proper play there was probably aim Momo and just hope Raiken doesn't kill me with one attack. Ah, easy clap. Oh, Nagas OP. Holy shit. What a sweep that was in the end. Jesus Christ. He was so prepared for that Nagas too. Jesus. Oh. Alright, I'll uh, skip through the next battle. Alrighty. What do we got? What do we got? Ooh, another opponent. Nice. I like when they're different. We choose the same team. I haven't had to switch over to the Yolo team yet. Alrighty, and he has Electric Boy. How scared are we of his team? I think my, my Fire Quish looks really good. And like Electric Quish, I don't care too much about. I have a few answers to it. Uh, Volorant is like a big ban for him, I think. Um, definitely think he bans Volorant. I see, I have so many ways through Kinu, but it's the Kinu partners that I'm scared of right now. Oh, I think I'm going to ban his Volorant. It's just such an annoying attempt to deal with, especially too, because I don't have any direct counters to it. Like, no Grumper on this team makes it hard. But what am I super, super scared of for his team? Like, he probably... Like, if I'm him, right, I'm probably just looking at, like, some Kinu Cernif against my team. But, I don't know. These three kind of just fuck Cernif up. Uh, so, he's banned that. Gonna go Volorant here, and then... Hopefully, that baits into Electric Koish, and I bring Volfi, I think. But I can, like, switch this out into... Like, Valash or Gulder, I think. Is people disrespecting uh, the guys today, though? I feel like... I think it's been banned once. No one wants to ban the guys. They all think they're set for it. Like, this guy's only entered the guys is this. And this dies to this. It's like, if I can get, like, third four, like these two... Okay, yeah. This was obvious. Again, I don't... I just don't care. I, th I think he was preparing for Valash, but he didn't have an answer for Volfi. Uh, hopefully he leaves Nagai's Gulda. Um, if I'm him looking at his team, like, Koish does do a bit here. Um, what else? I think he banned Koish. Oh, he does ban the Valash. Okay, he's super scared of it. I don't know why. Uh, so if I'm playing this combo, what am I scared of here? It's probably just Cernif, right? Yeah, I'll get rid of Cernif, because if that is Fond Whip, <coughs> Nagai's could be in, uh, in trouble.
What's my end game here though? Body quish not bad. Like I'm definitely just switching this into this, I think. So switching this out. What are his last two? So Volpe's not bad into this. I mean, I kind of want this for the end game, I think, just because. Do I want this? I do have two Toxic Thames. Yeah, I'm going to go Quish here. I have two Toxic Thames, so Water Cannon could be big. I think he has to take Volfi too, looking at my team. Like, this is only, like, I guess it's good against these two, but that's it. It's pretty bad against these three. At least Volfi can Plague, it can Dust Vortex. Let's see what he does, though. Nox a little. Okay. Nox could definitely be annoying this game, but I've got Voltron. I just got to keep it alive right now. Um, question is though, right? I don't, I don't think Koish stays in here, right? Unless he just thinks he's that fast. Like if he thinks he's fast enough to kill Voltron, but there's no way I keep Voltron in. And I'm just gonna go Gulda here. And then what can he... I mean, he doesn't... Like, unless he brings in Noxolotl, which I don't think is, like, the best thing. Maybe I should have even just trapped Riken there. Ah, oh, trapping Riken was probably the play. Hmm. What's he going to do here? I, I, I think you switch out Koish, right? It's really his only answer to Voltron. Like, Voltron kind of goes crazy, I think, later. If he doesn't uh, keep Koish alive. Cool to come to him. Please tell me he just, like, electric punches and Quetzalanos that slot. Okay, that was smart. So who am I trapping? Probably Noxalot, all right? Oh, I trapped Yola. Okay. That's pretty big. I might even... How do I want to play this now? So he does Ketsa into the Gulda slot. That's fine. I think definitely trapping Gulda there was actually probably the play. Um, so what do I need Volfi for? I mean, Volfi's pretty important, and I do just get hit by with a... Yeah, now you know what? I'm going to Toxic Ink. Oh, because I'm going to switch into guys here. So what do I want to do? I, I want to Toxic Ink something, because these two together, like, I'm assuming it's going to be, like, Oshi plus Ketsu or something into this slot, right? He's trapped. I'm just going to put him in range of Nagais, I think. That's definitely my play here. Do I need Nagais endgame? Uh, not really. Nagais seems okay. Let's go Nagais here, because I, I don't think he does much to Nagais. Like, I am Strange Vest too, so if I wanted, like, depending what they do here, I could even just set up a Madness buff, like, if I'm full HP still. So he does switch out Raikin, that's fine. Who's he bringing in? Kinu, okay. That's fine. I don't think this guy, even at that, is, is living me here. Because he's trapped in... What's he doing? Surely he Oshis into Nagais, right? Yeah, that's fine. As expected. That'll do fuck all. Yeah, I think I'm just going to set up a Madness buff here. There's no point in not doing it. Because Kinu probably doesn't want to stay. Like, this guy is forced to kind of stay. I don't know. We're going to Bamboozle. Let's just Bamboozle Madness buff. Play it smart. Make sure Yola doesn't get, like, any damage on me here. I'll probably still eat a... Oh, oh actually, I was probably a misplay. He'll, he'll probably try, like, uh, Savage plus Hypno into Gulda here. But it's fine. Even if he does that, like, Yola is forced to switch next turn. Ooh, okay. Interesting. Yeah, surely he just Savage suplexes into Gulda here. Yeah. That was to be expected. That's fine though. Gulda still goes first here. I can switch Voltron into the Nagai slot. He probably... Hmm. Now that I've buffed, the question is, is he going to keep Yolo in, right? Looking at his team, he doesn't really have anything to switch into it. So I'm just going to go Toxic Ink, I think. And we're going to go into Voltron here. Because good chance he either just switches and Toxic moves Nagai's. 
or he um, he keeps Yolo in just because he thinks it's dead. <clears throat> and he doesn't have anything to switch into it. That's all, that's basically in range of anything. Oh, he Oshi Dashied? Okay, Voltron's not dead, but not in a great spot. That's fine. We, we'll take those. Uh... And we're just going to Toxic Ink, secure this kill here, and we'll Hyperkinetic, oh, sorry, not Hyperkinetic, we'll Feather Gatling here. Because we're Savage Suplex, oh, ah, that's a fucking throw, ah, it's a bad throw by me, shit, I shouldn't have clicked on so fast, I needed to kill Yola there. Because Yola just, uh, he'll, he'll Savage Suplex into Voltron and kill it. Ah, that was bad, Noxalot wasn't doing anything, fuck. Yeah, that's just a, oh, I'm a genius, don't worry. He overexerts too, right? Easy clap. Alright, now I got a Voltron who's set up. Narcoleptic hit. Does he have a pillow? Oh, okay, what do we need to bring in here? So that thing's sleeping. If that's sleeping, I get a one free attack with Nagais, right? Actually, I don't want to bring Nagais in though, I don't think. We'll go we'll go Koish. I can I can water cannon the right slot here. I think if I get rid of this, uh Nagais probably just ends the game, right? Okay, so he does bring in his own Koish there. That was probably to be expected. Oh, let's quickly double check this. I need to know, does this Koish... I'm assuming it's... Is there any point in having a Synergy Master Electric Koish? At least just yet. It could be Iridescence. Uh, electric Koish does resist wind. Um, question is, do I keep Voltron? I think I do keep Voltron here. Like, he could just E-punch this. Like, someone has to, like, stay in right now. Oh, dude. Decisions, decisions. Like, Firefish is good here, but so is Voltron. Oh. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just go Water Cannon. I don't think he one-shots my Koish, and we'll go Nox Bomb. Because if he if he expects this to switch, he might just um, punch the the Nox the Mykoish. Oh, he water cannons. Okay, big. That's actually massive too. That's a very like, dude. My my fish is fast, fast. Like this is like three eighty speed on my koish. Like that's a very fucking fast koish. So the fact like he he's got to be five hundred. He's just max max. So this thing's definitely dead. This guy probably dies to hyperkinetic, right? I'm gonna switch this into Volfi and we're just gonna hyperkinetic this slot. Oh, do I hyper? Yeah, fuck it, hyperkinetic. I just wanna make sure here if he does E punch the the Koi slot that uh I'm alive. I don't think this kills Nox, but the good thing is if it puts him in range of his ability. Ah, oh, he's dead, don't worry. Hopefully he just E-punches Volfi and this whole play just fucking works out perfectly. Okay, yeah. Gets rid of Volorant, that's fine. He dies here, puts him down to what, Kindred Raikon, yeah? I got Volfi in, which means I do have Gus Vortex at the ready. And I just bring in the guys, I think. Do I bring in the guys? You know what, no, we're gonna bring in Firefish here. Bring in Firefish and we uh, try to get rid of Kinu. If we get rid of Kinu, I know that the, the guys just beats Raikon 101, especially with Strange Fest. That's fine, this guy's nothing. Do I want oh do I one tap this though? I don't think I actually one shot this, but that shouldn't matter. I don't think Raiken can kill my Koish right now. And he definitely can't kill Volfi. Beta burst. Oh, does that actually kill Koish? That might kill Koish. It does kill Koish. Fuck, alright, that's fine. I don't think I one shot this guy, but he can't kill the guys with these two, I don't think. That's easy. Alright, so he definitely does to Nagai's Fury if it's up still. I think it's up. Double check, make sure. Yeah, nothing in the back. Okay. Trap you. Nagai's Fury. That kills Raiken. That should get Kino in range of the eventual sweep. I wonder what Kino does here. Like, Raiken's definitely dead.
Oh, he actually gets the Emberoth. That's not ideal. I don't think it changes anything. That should do 30 to Kinu. Yeah, 31. Not bad. That shouldn't kill Nagais. Oh. He doesn't want to hit Nagais. Jeez, 20% on that? That's insane. Oh, it's, yeah, it's 20, right? Actually, fuck. It's a resisted attack. Alrighty. Um, yeah, I think... It's technically, I think technically Dust Vortex is my best move, right? We just Psy Surge it. Endgame Nuggeist, 2 OP. Nuggeist, the goat. Hey, you. If you like the video, leave a like. Maybe comment, tell me what you think I could do better. Well, I did good, maybe. I don't know. Subscribe. Hey, and while you're at it, why don't you follow us on Twitch? Link in the description. Peace out.